This is the story of an ordinary boy. The boy enjoyed sleeping for long hours, expressing himself through music, and spent countless hours playing video games. He was, however, always unfortunate with girls. It should be made clear that this is not a love story. Instead, this is a lesson. Because unlike some stories, this is the tale of Dawn and his stalker. The first time Dawn met his unlikely stalker was in the library. He absolutely loathed this place. Books, books, and more books. Dawn heard a wrestling on his side and jumped to avoid his stalker. He had no idea what he looked like, but it horrified him to no end as he ran away. The second encounter with his dreadful stalker, he was as helpless as a lamb. It is not peculiar for Dawn to be sleeping in an empty class, for he always comes to class late. And when I say late, I mean three hours late. But for some reason, there was this one time he felt a shadow approaching him as he slept. And there it was, the stalker. The relentless stalker proved too much for our Don. To escape his turmoil, he frequented an empty hall to work on his assignments. I mean, he looks at pictures of cats and unicorns. But his pursuer was always persistent. Suddenly, the blinding light flashed on his beady eyes. And as he regained composure, there it was, creeping slowly. Don is helpless. He falls, he falls and tried to crawl away in fear. No, please no, said Don. The stalker who had the noblest intention said, I'm just trying to help you, while stroking his Chinese beard. Ah, oh, screamed Don. And that, my friends, is the story of Don. He never really did confront his terror, and at some point, his stalker stopped following him and found a new prey. But Don did not feel relieved as waves upon waves of regret crashed down on him. And we should learn from his costly mistake, because he flunked out of university.